electric types. Static and body slam can pair electric types, I think, and has electric type. Yeah, Glare can also do it as well. Oh, wait, isn't this team looks so dope? It's got, I think it's got Yawn stuff, it's got Clefairy Spectria stuff, it's got everything that I don't want to face stuff. Um, interesting, guys. I think we're in for, we, we're gonna be in for a treat here, guys. I need a hell out. Good luck on the ladder. Yo, thank you so much. And yeah, thanks for coming today. Hopefully, you had a great time. No coverage. Legendary gang. <laughs> no coverage legendary gang. Is that is this what you call this? No coverage legendary gang? Okay, let's go with Grimstyle Tapufini, I think. Uh if he leads Spectrium, my Metagross will get absolutely dunked. Oh actually we could go for Thunderous Urshifu. That is a good shout. But I'm so scared of maybe Thunderous. Maybe we we can go Thunderous. Uh, Grimstar here. Or oh, Grimstar Tapufini. And we can just like, uh, let's go with this lead. Stool out a little bit of Dynamax. Like, if we can get Carmines off, we can get Carmines off and we can Dynamax Tapufini. And then, if not, we can have a back end of Thunderous Urshifu with a Dynamax Thunderous. Uh, go for max airstreams and we go like Wicked Blows every time. Bruh, you have four legendaries and a pseudo legend. Oh, that, my team, my team. I guess so, I guess so. Yeah, my, my team does not have a lot of coverage. It, it's actually unfortunate. But I'm just showcasing you guys Raikou. Raikou's pretty good. I think this is the best team for it though. I mean, some kind of like physical attacker team. It's not bad. No coverage of Legend Gang. Yeah, that's true too. Um. Let's go with uh, this, and uh, let's go for Calm Mind. If we can get a Calm Mind off, uh, I think we'll be in a pretty decent shape. Because he's definitely Dynamaxing here, unless he goes for a Nasty Plot setup here, which he might. Uh, I've been seeing a lot of Nasty Plot on the Spectria. Nasty Plot Spectria is pretty nasty. But we'll see. We'll see what he's up to. We'll see what he's up to. Damn, this guy's thinking hard and hard, long and hard. Helping hands doesn't Dynamax. That's so sad. Not as good as weakness policy. Yeah, definitely not as good as weakness policy. Helping hands much shot though. I actually like this. I actually like this because I got off my. I got off my Calm Mind, which is so good, so good. Now I can tank even more stuff uh, with the light screen. Uh, and I think we can just go for a Spirit Break here. Uh, I'm not going to go for Sucker Punch in case of redirection. And we can just spa start spamming Muddy Water here, or just go for another Calm Mind. I think another Calm Mind is greedy, but it's good if, if he doesn't Dynamax it. If he doesn't Dynamax and target Tapufini, it's really, really good. Okay, okay. Nice Sue, nice Sue, nice Sue. So, the ideal play for him Dynamaxing this turn was the Spirit Break plus Protect. Because then we get a special attack drop. But now he Dynamaxed his Spectria, which is very, very good for us. He helping hands too. Uh, and hopefully, our Grimmsnarl survives this. Max Strike comes through. Okay. Oh, thank god it survived. And we get that an another special attack drop. Which is huge. Absolutely huge, guys. We get one more Calm, mood, calm Mind off. Spirit Break comes out. Does a sizable amount of damage too. Uh, and you know, Spirit Break is actually so insane. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna go with a reflect here. Just just to reflect, because otherwise uh Oh actually we we can be greedy. We can be like really greedy and just go for another spirit break because he has to attack with his um he, he has to either attack with his 
um, Clefairy or he doesn't. Or he doesn't kill the Grim Snarl. Or he has to waste one more turn. So let's see what he goes for. He goes for Max Quick this turn. Okay. On to the Grim Snarl. Okay, nice. So two turns wasted uh, on on the Spectria. And what does he go for on the Clefairy here? He didn't help enhance this time round. Uh, probably maybe Sing this time, actually. Grimnado is huge. Muddy Water connects, which is nice. Nice accuracy drop too. Heal Pulse. Oh, Jesus. Okay, this is a problem. This guy's on Heal Pulse. Heal freaking Pulse, boys. <laughs> Okay, let's just go into Thunderous here. Uh, the safe play here is the Max Guard. I think I shall. I think I'll Max Guard here. Because then we get the fine boost and everything. And uh, we should be able to survive the tap with Tapufini with that many Calm Mind boost. Um, yeah. Holy moly, there's a sudden storm outside my house. Yo, is that Typhoon coming out? <laughs> is it safe over there? Uh, I think we go for Mind blo moon, moon Blast onto the Clefairy here. But he could very well protect it, so let's just go for Muddy Water. Just chip away at everything. Let's see what he opts for onto... Like, he either he either goes for Max Quakes, or he... he Gives me a Defiant Boost. Or he attacks into Max Max Guard. Let's see what he opts for here. He goes for Helping Hands. Okay. Uh, plus... This could be a little bit scary this turn. Okay, nice. So... Okay, nice. So now this turn we can go for Max Airstream here, onto the Spectria, and just go for Muddy Water here. I'm, I'm so glad that we got two Calm Minds boosts off before. Uh, yeah, it was pretty shady when he didn't go for anything. Um, when he didn't Dynamax straight away. Or, this game could have been like really bad if he went for Nasty Plot too. Like, Nasty Plot Spectria with no protect is so freaking strong. I think that was Binji, uh, Binji Wang's team. He had like Sword Dance and Nasty Plot Spectria and Glastria, which was crazy. Freaking crazy, boys. Well, I got a Spadef drop. That is kind of sad, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, it was Lum Glacier with Sword Dance, dude. It was crazy good. It was crazy good. Like, it, it made sense as well, because he had Clefairy support, so he could follow me plus Nasty Plot, plot and, and do stuff like that. Get away with it as well. Nice, the Shadow Ball actually didn't end up doing that much damage here either. This I want to see the follow me from this Clefairy though. He has not clicked follow me once. I want to see it. Show me that. Show me that follow me. Show me that freaking follow me, boys. I want to see it. Reggie Alecky. Okay, I don't want to see that follow me anymore. <laughs> I don't want to see that follow me. That follow me is kind of scary. I'm going to protect her. Do, do I think I survived? Nah, I have no chance of surviving. I do have a light screen up, but I'm a little bit scared. So I'd rather just kill the Clefairy here. He might protect her though. But he's definitely just going to target the Tapu Fini here. Max Action comes through. 
Unfortunately, I didn't get to see the follow me. He doesn't like to follow me, this Clefairy. He likes to go for everything but the follow me. I wonder if plus two airstream knocks out. Um, ho ho! <laughs> I, I hope plus two airstream, uh, plus two speed on Thunderous is faster than Reggie Eleki, but we'll find out. I mean, plus one now, but we'll see. We'll see, we'll see. But we have that Defiant boost though. Oof, okay. Your Feeny will survive, my Feeny will survive. Okay. Let's just go for it then. <laughs> Let's just go for the... Alright, uh, let's just go for the knockout. One of these guys must be on Focus Sash. We'll find out who's on the Focus Sash. Specs might kill it. Nilfini will survive. Oh, plus one is faster than Regieliki. Okay. That's a slow Regieliki, man. That's a slow Regieliki. Um. <laughs> Okay, the, I found the sash, boys. I found the sash. How fast is Raikou again? I think it's 120. That did so much damage. Um, <laughs> I think Raikou is 120. Let me check quickly. One fifteen, one fifteen in between. Yeah, one fifteen speed. That's pretty fast, right? That's faster than most things. Uh, I think that's... Yeah, that's faster than most things in the meta. That's faster than Thunderous. And that, that's my benchmark. Thunderous is my benchmark here. Yeah. I think plus one Raikou outspeeds Eleki, so plus one Fundy might be able to. Have you been using Raikou a lot? You seem to know that plus one Raikou outspeeds Eleki. But it also depends though. Because Reggie Eleki is not always max speed. I I think if Re Re um, Reggie Eleki is max speed, there's no way it outspeeds for sure. I was doing Reggie Eleki speed counts, right, like full speed, like max speed. Timid. <laughs> Gets outsped at plus one. Really? Damn, it's not that fast then. Okay, I, I was overestimating it. Yo, we 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 what? We we're memeing our way high in the ladder, guys. Can't believe this. 